Hey, Jessica, how are you today? Hey, Rachel, good to see you again. Good, how's everything been since we visited last week? Um, you know, I mean, it's been good other than, you know, the my divorce was finalized um, with, with my wife, or well, my ex-wife now. So we're just still trying to adjust to, you know, Josiah going between the two houses, but yeah. it's been okay. Good. So it, it sounds like he is adjusting pretty well. Yeah, we're getting there. Good. Well, you know, if, if we need to talk through anything, you just let me know. Thank you. appreciate it. If you remember, we talked last week about doing an ages and stages questionnaire on Josiah. And basically what this is, is I'm going to ask you a whole lot of questions, but we're going to see how well Josiah is doing. And it's going to look at communication and his gross motor um, development and those kind of things to really just let us know if he's reaching some milestones. And if not, maybe what can we do to help Josiah out? Okay. Okay. And I appreciate us doing this via Zoom. I know we really had hoped that we could do it in person. So we're, we're going to make the best of this situation. Okay. Okay. All right. So if we're working with Josiah around the house and maybe y'all are doing some chores, can he follow simple things like put the toy on the table? If he wants to. Right. Yeah, two year olds, it can be a little tricky. <laughs> <laughs> sure. uh, what about like if you washed hands, bring me a towel? Um, yeah, I, I think I just forget like how little he is. So I kind of put things up a little bit higher. So it makes it hard for him to get things like towels and stuff. Well, one, I mean, remember putting things up high is part of what we've talked about with safety planning for Josiah, right? Like we don't want him to touch some things. Um, but if he does need that towel, how well does he do communicating with you in order to get that towel? Well, he just kind of screams at me to help him. Uh, <laughs> Josiah, so. he's found that voice, didn't he? <laughs> <laughs> he did. Oh, my goodness. So it sounds like he's doing well with these tasks. So he is starting to be able to identify things. I think so. Mom, you're doing such a great job between you and your partner. Y'all have done such great work with him. Well, thank you. Appreciate it. Um, we're going to talk about, hey, we, remember with everything that's going on, we still got this two-year-old guy and he's doing so well. So let's talk about some gross motor. Okay. This is more about how his arms and legs move around. Okay. So does your child walk down the stairs? I know you have like one stair out of your home. How does he do walking out of down, up and down stairs? He does pretty well, like you said, I mean, you've been to our house before, there, there aren't a lot of stairs, but he's been recently going to my parents' house since I have to go back to work, and that's just kind of like a temporary childcare situation, but there's stairs at my parents' house that he's been trying out. Okay, how has he been doing with those stairs? Um, well, he's kind of clumsy, so he falls down a bunch. So he's learning. I, I remember learning those stairs at my grandparents, the little butt scoot downstairs, right? It was a fun game, though, so maybe we'll work on that. How does he enjoy the transition of going to your parents' house during the day? Oh, he loves his toots and his papa. I mean, they, they, they spoil him, for sure. I'm sure they're loving it just as much. And remember how important this is, all these extra relationships and time with grandparents, how it's going to help. If you remember, we talked about these healthy relationships really help with his adult health as he grows. Yeah, and I guess that's kind of a good thing that has come out of, you know, the, yeah. the divorce with my partner, if you think about it like that. There you go. What about jumping? Do you ever see Josiah like try and jump and we see both feet off the ground or maybe just one foot? Um, You know what? I... I know he likes to jump off of things, particularly from high places, um, but I've never actually like seen him jump. I've only kind mm -hmm. of seen him land or fall. Well, one, your mom nerves, I'm sure that gets you, right? These, yeah. Oh, toddlers, they can go all out. But <laughs> I think that would be something again, too, like we can maybe play with him some more and we'll see how he does with jumping. We don't have to say. Yes or no? We can say sometimes right now. Okay. And, and you know what? Like some of these questions, I feel like I've been saying no or I'm not sure or sometimes. Um, is there any chance that we could schedule something for you to come 
to the house and you could kind of see what he does and maybe help me like figure out how to do it as well absolutely I think that's a great idea Jessica let's schedule and we can get a time when when you both are home you're off work or even if your partner is free too we could have everybody come together and really work with Josiah as we work through these okay thank you Rachel I appreciate it thanks thanks Jessica